Ah, I heard we had a new initiate on the premises. I was just checking my notes and realized the details concerning you are sorely lacking. We'll need to rectify that before too long. She did. Interesting. I wonder what she's planning this time. Well, I'm certain everything will become clear, eventually. Even you, I suppose. Aren't you familiar with the cherished Black Marsh custom? Consuming various venomous concoctions to bolster our natural immunity? I drank so much my tongue turned green. Ha! <laughs> the new initiates fall for that every time. And you as well, Initiate. I look forward to interviewing you at length when you have some time. For my journals, of course. I keep meticulous records. I'll help you, you'll help me. Isn't that what the Bretons call a win-win? What more could you possibly need to know? I am a Shadow Scale. My life begins and ends with the Dark Brotherhood. I could have sworn I explained this before. Let me check my notes. Hmm. Well, like other Argonians born under the sign of the Shadow, I was taken upon hatching and trained to be an assassin. That makes me a good killer. A very good killer. What an intriguing inquiry. Attempting to ascertain if I actually like it here, or something more subtle. Well, like or dislike is meaningless. I served the Matron as I served my former sanctuary. And as I served Black Marsh when called upon. The river carries us where it will, and that's all I prefer to say about that at this time. I was there, now I am here. As are you, Initiate. Perhaps, depending upon what you mean by something and me. Rest assured, whatever musings and observations I record herein are strictly confidential. Now this one I know I've written down. Study the five tenets. Learn them. Memorize them. Live them. There's a copy in the sanctuary. Someplace. I'd let you look at this one, but I don't let anybody read my journals. That would be... inadvisable. Such a curious mind. Then listen carefully, Initiate. Contracts must be taken seriously. Always obey the Matron's instructions to the letter, and don't get yourself killed. Though that probably goes without saying. So you're the new initiate. Hmm. You're certainly cuter than the last one. And why wouldn't she, darling? I am her favorite, after all. As a matter of fact, I'm everyone's favorite. I'm sure you'll agree soon enough. Anyway, it's a pleasure to meet you. May the Night Mother forever hold you in her cold and loving embrace. Forward. Believe me, this is my shy and unimposing side. After all, we wouldn't want to give my beloved Simbar the wrong idea, would we? Find me later, and I'll show you what forward really looks like. <laughs> oh, you really are too easy, my darling. I'm just having fun with you. I suppose I get that from my family heritage. The Motieres are rich, powerful, and blessed with good looks, and a wicked sense of humor. Just play along and enjoy. Oh, there's nothing noble about my family. But I left that all behind. The wealth, the boredom, the servants waiting on me hand and foot. One day, I strangled my handmaid with a golden chain. And here I am. Life in the Brotherhood suits me. You shouldn't know anything, darling. We're a secret organization, after all. I suppose I can tell you that we serve the Night Mother. Her cold embrace binds us together. Never dishonor her. 
Our contracts aren't mere tasks. We carry out her will. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. These words, as part of a complex ritual, form the Black Sacrament, the means by which those in need pray to the Night Mother. Our mother hears the prayer and whispers to the listener. The listener sends a speaker to arrange the details and create the contract. Then the speaker selects an assassin to carry out our mother's will. It's more than just a job. It's a calling. Ah, this just got much too serious for my days, darling. Let's talk about something, oh, I don't know, more decadent. Like how I'd be nibbling on your ear if Simbar wasn't here. He's watching, isn't he? Maybe a little nibble is in order, hmm? A few. The speaker sends new initiates to the sanctuary every so often. New blood, you understand. Before you, there was a charming young lad from Glenumbra. Van something, I believe. A shame, really. He was too scrumptious to die so soon. Mind your tongue, Initiate. We're the murderers, not the victims here. But I suppose the circumstances were somewhat... unusual? Someone left Van pinned to the wall of the inn in Kavach, held up with multiple daggers. When I find the villain... You don't hunt the hunters. The Brotherhood hunts you. Anything else is a crime against the natural order. But... Enough of this dark talk. We're just working ourselves into a tizzy. I'd much rather get excited about something more... enticing. So you're the new recruit, huh? No, don't tell me your name. I'll, uh, just call you New Blade. It's easier to remember, and, uh, <laughs> it's not like I'm gonna know you for very long. Yes, New Blade. That's so much better. Oh, I didn't mean to offend you. I just believe in full disclosure. We've lost an initiate and a fully trained assassin recently. Mirabelle's in denial, but I know what's happening. Someone's hunting the Brotherhood, and you make a tempting target. Sure you can. So could Dorisa. She still ended up face down in an anvil alley with her throat slit from ear to ear. Whoever murdered her has some impressive skills. I'll give them that. Stay sharp, New Blade. We're not alone in the shadows anymore. Oh, it's a long and sordid tale of romance and daring do or if you prefer the short version i was apprenticed to a smith in sentinel loved the trade hated my master he liked to hammer more than just metal when i had enough i killed him oh no that was just the beginning of my story i was young and stupid back then i ran but uh, apparently not far or fast enough got to spend some quality time in a hammerfell dungeon for my actions hmm Eight years, if I recall correctly. Well, it wasn't sunshine and camel milk, but I survived. Met some people, learned some lessons. When one of the guards got sloppy, I was ready to act. Simple as that. Of course, my old life was over, but at least I was free. Hey, I had to make a living. I was branded as a killer, so killing was what I did. Worked for the crime boss Bashira for a while. Then I had a visit one night. The speaker scared the piss out of me, but I couldn't refuse his generous offer. The Dark Brotherhood has been good to me. They taught me to focus my anger, to let the Dread Father work through me. I have a home, an income, and a set of rules to live by. Life makes sense to me here in the Sanctuary. 
Oh, New Blade, there are always rules. The trick is to learn what they are before you get your hand caught in the sweet roll box. For us, it's all about the five tenets. I'm sure there's a book about them somewhere in the sanctuary. Dorisa and Van. One was an experienced assassin who knew her business. The other was a raw recruit with hardly any blood on his blade. Kind of like you, New Blade. It could have been coincidence, but I think they were targeted by the same killer. Just a feeling, I guess. And the way they were left for all the world to see. Someone was proud of their work and wanted everyone to know it. And it had to be a professional. Dorisa was too good to be taken down by an amateur. Matron Astara tells us what to think, not the other way around. But yes, we've talked about this. All we can do is stay alert and try to figure out who's behind the murders. Until then, we're just jumping at shadows. Very dangerous shadows. The Dark Brotherhood has been good to me. It's all right, little one. Just a new smell. Your new brother or sister must be here. Do you want to meet them? Come on now, Hilda. Don't be shy. Sorry, she can be skittish around strangers. New sister! Welcome! Welcome! You need anything, anything at all. You come to me, yes? Of course! It's important to get to know everyone. You're part of the family now, and family helps each other. It's what we do. Oh, that's not a werewolf. Uh, well, I guess it is. But it's also little Hildegard. She's really sweet, but you'll need to say hello later. She still doesn't have the hang of controlling her transformations. Hildegard is like the little sister I never had, but her true family was awful. They drank the blood of werebeasts. It's a dangerous practice, but not entirely unheard of in Nordlands. They even forced their children to participate. We assume so. But as to why she can't control her transformations, that remains a mystery. She lost control one day and hurt another member of the tribe. They cursed her and she ran away. I found her later. She was confused, alone. Nearly mad. I'm a skilled hunter. Taming animals is almost second nature to me. It took time, but she came to trust me. Accepted me as her big brother. Before that happened, though, she nearly tore my face off. See? I still have the scar. I always liked to hunt and fight. I became a soldier, but that turned out to be more about waiting around than actual battle. So I sold my sword as a mercenary, made some enemies, and soon found out that other cell swords were being paid to kill me. Indeed I did. Kept a low profile in town, spent most of my time in the wilderness. I almost decided to stop running, and then I found little Hilda. She became my reason to go on living. Well, you know, there are some things we just don't talk about in public. I hope you understand. I will tell you that we love it here. We're part of the best family in the whole world. And we're glad to have you with us. I'm sure Hilda agrees.
You must be the new initiate. I've heard some unbelievable things about you. Still, you can't be too good. Your name hasn't appeared on one of my contracts yet. What? Oh, that's a Dark Brotherhood joke. Don't you have a sense of humor? Did she now? Are you sure that's what she told you to do? Wouldn't want you to get in trouble your first day in the Sanctuary. Now that you're here, we might as well discuss your training. Don't repeat what I say. It annoys me. Now where was I? Oh yes, your training. Complete a contract, receive a reward. Prove yourself, and more significant contracts will be made available to you. It's simple, really. I don't expect you to last a week, but as long as you're still here... Ready for your first contract, Initiate? Not everyone appeals to the Dark Brotherhood through the Black Sacrament. For those with copious amounts of gold to spare, we usually indulge their more mundane requests. Are you ready to take on your first contract? <laughs> 